Hello everyone, welcome to my another video. Today we discuss about a special MCQ on gastrointestinal disorders under pediatric nursing. This is part 1. For more important MCQ on nursing subjects, make sure you subscribe to this channel. Question number 1. What is the main reason for under 5 morbidity and mortality. Option A malnutrition, B diarrheal disease, C asphyxia, D leukemia. Right answer is option B diarrheal disease. Diarrheal disease is the most common cause of under 5 mortality and morbidity in India. Malnutrition is the factors which is making children more vulnerable to other disease condition. Next question. Projectile vomiting is a characteristic of which of the following conditions? Option A. Pyloric stenosis B. Hernia C. Imperforate anus D. Appendicitis Right answer is option A pyloric stenosis. Pyloric stenosis is a narrowing of the opening from the stomach to the first part of the small intestine characterized by projectile vomiting without the presence of bile. This occurs due to the hypertrophic pylorus muscles which obstructs the gastric pathway. Next question. Identify the food items need to be avoided in a client with celiac disease. Option A. Wheat B. Rye C. Oats D. All of the above Right answer is Option D. All of the above Celiac disease is an autoimmune disease and child with celiac disease need to avoid food items contain gluten protein. This protein is present in food items such as wheat, barley, oats and rye. Next question. While administering IV fluid for the management of dehydration, which among the following is the most important nursing intervention? Option A. Change the IV set 24 hourly. B. Maintain intake and output chart. C. Continuing the prescribed rate of flow. D. Maintaining the fluid at body temperature. Right answer is Option C. Continuing the prescribed rate of flow. Prescribed flow rate need to be followed. Otherwise, it can lead to fluid overload and further problems in children. Next question. Race syndrome is associated with Option A. Hemolytic transfusion reactions B. Biliary colic C. Sickle cell crisis the use of aspirin with viral illness. Right answer is option D. Use of aspirin with viral illness. Race syndrome is associated with the use of aspirin with viral illness. It is a rare but serious condition that causes swelling in the liver and brain. Race syndrome most often affects children. Next question. What is the most common bacterial cause of diarrhea in children? Option A. E. coli B. Salmonella C. Staphylococcus D. Cigella Right answer is Option A. E. coli E. coli is the most common bacterial cause of diarrhea in children. 
नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन वट इज दी कोज ऑफ गेस्ट्रो इसोफिजियल रिफ्लक्स डिजीज ऑप्शन ए हाइटल हार्निया बी प्रिटर्म इनफेन्स सी एकालेसिया डी ऑल ऑफ दि एब राइट एन्सार इज अपन डि ऑल ऑफ दि एब गेस्ट्रो इसोफिजियल रिफ्लक्स डिजीज इज ए बेक फ्लो अफ गेस्ट्रिक कन्टेन्स इन टू दि इसोफेगस उइथ और उइदाउट रिजाजिटेशन हाइटल हार्निया प्रिटम इनफेन्स एकालेसिया आर दि कोजेस अफ गेस्ट्रो इसोफिजियल रिफ्लक्स डिजीज नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इमिडियेट पोस्ट अपारेटिव केयर फलोईंग ट्रेकिओ इसोफिजियल रिपेयर सार्जारी इज अपशन ए एडमिनिस्टार पेन किलार्स बी मेन्टेन पेटेन टेयर वे सी मेन्टेन पेरेन्टेल फ्लुइड इनफ्यूजन डि डू केयर फर अल एंड सकशन राइट एन्सार इज अपन बी मेन्टेन पेटेन टेयर वे एयर वे मेन्टेनेस इज दि हायेस्ट प्रायरिटी आफ्टार सार्जारी सो मेन्टेन ए पेटेन टेयर वे प्लेस एन इम्पर्टेन्ट रोल इन दि इमिडियेट पोस्ट अपारेटिव पीरियड नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इनभार्टोग्राम इज यूज फर दि डायगनोसिस अफ अपन एनोरेक्टल मालफर्मेशन बी ट्रेकिओ इसोफिजियल फिस्तुला सी क्लैफ्ट लिफ्ट एंड पेलेट डि हिस्पुन डिजीज राइट एन्सार इज अपन ए एनोरेक्टल मालफर्मेशन Inverterogram is used for the diagnosis of anorectal malformations. Anorectal malformations are wide spectrum of developmental deformities involving distal anus and rectum as well as urinary and genital tract. Next question Following albendazole therapy, nurse need to educate the parents to observe stool for option A. Melina, B. Hematocysia, C. Pieces of worms, D. Clay colored stool. Right answer is option C. Pieces of worms. Albendazole is a deworming medication and its administration leads to killing and passage of worms in the stool. So this is the today's video. Thank you so much for watching my video.